Welcome to Wildlife in Focus. This episode is everything you need to know about the pheasant, scientific name Phasianus colchicus. Male pheasants exhibit striking bronze plumage, complemented by a red face and wattle, a green neck adorned with a white ring, and an elongated tail. In contrast, female pheasants present a sandy brown coloration featuring intricate black patterns. It is important to note that pheasants are generally larger than partridges and possess longer tails. Males have sharp spurs, which they utilize in confrontations with rivals. The majority of pheasants found in the UK are reared for shooting, originating from imported eggs and chicks with millions released into the wild each year. There, they consume a diverse diet of invertebrates, seeds, berries, and leaves. It is claimed that the sheer number of pheasant released are damaging to the natural environment due to the number of invertebrates and plant material that they consume. Logically, this seems a likely scenario. However, there is a general lack of scientific research to prove or disprove the assertion. They can be found in their highest densities in pastoral and arable land, as well as deciduous forests and reed beds. However, they can be found in a range of environments wherever there is sufficient cover for them to hide. The pheasant is the most prevalent bird in the United Kingdom's countryside. Pheasant populations are on the rise across the country, except in the far northwestern region. Did you know? Pheasants originated from Asia and were introduced to Europe by the Romans, likely arriving in the United Kingdom with the Normans in the 11th century. You will frequently hear pheasant before you see them, particularly during the breeding season when the males establish their territories by making drumming sounds with their wings. Their calls are croaky, similar to that of a domestic rooster. Female common pheasants establish their nests in fields or bordering habitats where they typically lay a dozen or more eggs that they incubate independently. The offspring are born precocial, meaning that the nestlings are born in an advanced state and able to move around and feed themselves almost immediately. Nestlings mature at a rapid pace, achieving flight capability within two weeks and remaining in proximity to their mother for an additional six to seven weeks.